Epicerf Medical, they produce and sell orthopedic implants for knee injuries. And we're here at their Stockholm office to find out what makes this business so exciting. Hey, Hi, Rosie. How are you? Nice to see you. Yes, yeah, it's you. Great to have you here at Epicerf today. Thanks for having me. We develop and design the next generation of orthopedic implants. We're disruptors because our technology is patient-specific, aimed at treating early-stage knee pain. What is it that makes Episurf's implants so great? What makes them stand out? What makes them stand out? Super question. I love Episurf products. I would use Episurf products. The, what attracted me to this technology was the fact that it was patient-specific, designed for an individual's knee. Every knee is different. Every anatomy is different. What we do through our design and what makes us stand out clinically in terms of our performance, post-surgical performance, is the patient-specific design. It addresses the exact defect in the patient's knee. That's what really is our unique selling feature. How many patients have received your implants today and how are they feeling? Today we have 95 patients who've received the epicelar implant. They've had no revisions and what that means is nothing has been taken out surgically, no surgical revisions, we've had no adverse effects. What we do have is universal improvement in pain and mobility. I'll give you an example of one patient who's had his epicelar in for three and a half years now. He's a physical edu education teacher, high demanding job, lots of activity, he's back to full sport and of course doing his job as a physical education teacher with zero pain. I'm a little bit curious as to what incentives the doctors have for using your specific implants. Well there's a key feature to our technology. We call it a damage marking report. We've branded it. It's called epioscopy. This is the report that enables the surgeon to actually see the cartilage lesion and pre-plan the surgery. We also use this bit of reporting to actually develop and design the patient-specific implant itself. It's a great tool for surgeons to make the right clinical decision, it helps. It really does help them in their clinical practice to, to have a great surgery. So you're talking about the customer-centric strategy. Could you tell us what this means? Everything we do at Episurf is based on patient specificity. We have two customer groups, our surgeons and the patients they actually serve. What our technology does, it builds a perfect bridge between patients and surgeons to enable a great clinical outcome, customer-centric. How are these implants being produced? Episurf's core competency is developing and designing patient-specific implants. All of this very important work is done here in our Stockholm office by a highly skilled team of biomedical engineers. Recently you reported that over 100 clinics are connected to your IT platform MyFidelity, which you claim to be a competitive advantage. Could you just explain why this is? MyFidelity is the cloud-based platform that runs the company. It's the engine of our company. We develop, we design, we manufacture, and our surgeons place orders through MyFidelity. So it gives us a, really a way to communicate a constant dialogue with our customers. We know when they're planning their surgeries, we know what concerns they have over damage marking, we answer their questions through it. So it's a communication tool that en enables us to really stay on top of what's happening with our customers. It's a definite competitive advantage. Two global trends that you benefit from are an increasing life expectancy and obesity. So why does the demand for your products go up due to these trends? Well, we all know as we age, and I'll give you an example. My dear old dad is 95 years old now. We expect a quality of life. Therefore, people are seeking treatment earlier for progressive degenerative knee problems. We know that the annual number of knee replacements globally is going up year after year. We know that the obesity rates are increasing year after year. These two trends converge. People will need treatment. That means Epicelar is just in a great place at a great time whereby this group of patients is expanding. How do you generate revenue? What is it that you sell? We actually sell the implant itself along with the damage marking report. We have one revenue stream at the moment, which is the implant, the toolkit, and the damage marking report sold as a complete unit. We intend in the future to introduce additional revenue streams via new software products. How are your products priced compared to existing? implant solutions? Our products are priced very fairly, they're very market competitive, but in a way that's irrelevant. We work with each of the reimbursement systems in our European countries to get the best pricing we can, because as we know, we work largely with a public healthcare funded system across Europe. 
reimbursement codes are actually preset for various types of technologies. So we work hard to ensure we can get the maximum reimbursement we are entitled to under specific codes for orthopedic implant technology. How much does the market for knee implants amount to? The market is worth $8.1 billion annually. It's largely dominated by four players. There are 2.5 million annual knee procedures done. What we know is the big companies are no longer innovating. What's so exciting about EpiSurf is we are disruptive and it makes for a great opportunity for us to take market share and become a player in this very, very sizable market. So what can you tell us about your sales strategy for reaching this market? Well, you can imagine in such a sizable market, it's so important for us to be really, really focused in terms of where we're going and who we're partnering with. Right now, we are partnering with key orthopedic surgical specialists, particularly sports medicine specialists, in key centers across Europe. We will continue to do that to build the volume numbers before we feel comfortable when it's time to spread out our activity. So it's a very focused sales strategy right now. Right surgeons in the right centers. You were appointed CEO in 2015, but what did you do prior to this? Well, I've spent my entire career, over 25 years, in medical technology companies. The field has always excited me because I could understand way back then, 25 years ago, the impact technology could have for a surgeon, as a user, for a patient, as an end user of a technology. It intrigued me, I liked it, and I decided to spend my career here. I started out in sales and marketing, worked my way up through some major New York Stock Exchange listed med tech companies, and also worked in some large FTSE 100 companies as well, always on the commercial side of the business, eventually reaching CEO position in the early 2000s. Since then, I have led four high-tech innovation companies, taking novel technology and mainstreaming it. Concluding our interview here, Rosemary, what do you find most exciting about your job here at EPICER? Uh, well, every day is different. Uh, the diversity, the challenges, the opportunities to take such an awesome technology, to bring it to a wider audience of surgeons and patients. We have, a, you know, we have an ethos here. We, we want to change the world one knee at a time, and we're doing it. It's a fun job. It's a great job. I have a great team of people, and we're helping people every day to live better lives. Well, thanks for today, Rosie. Thank you, Ollie. It's been super. I really enjoyed our time together. Yeah, same here. All Looking forward to the next time. See you soon. See you. Bye.